All right, don't forget your exams start tomorrow. Uh, do you need to put in any last minute study? You bet your, you bet your furry butt I do. You got plants today? Dude, you need a study, bro. No, I cannot hang out with you, dude. I'm sorry. And then get my ass in the library and study, study, study. Uh, by the way, really quick pro tip for any of you guys. If you, oh, I guess a fun fact about me. I guess I identify with having um, photogenic memory, which means like if I read something or if I see something, it's like, it's like a picture in my mind. So I have never studied in my life. I've never studied for anything ever. I have never, and it boggles my mind too how like that's how people learn, but like repetition and, and stuff like that. But I have never in my entire life ever come home, opened a book and just kept reading something over and over until it's until it's in, ingrained in my head. There have been moments like I do like projects and stuff like that, but I've never like legitimately like studied for anything. Like if I were to read a chapter of a book or something, if we're like doing a, like a class book or you know, a school assignment or something, and that's gonna be on the test, I usually just read, same thing with words. Like if a word is blatantly spelled wrong, my brain, if I've seen the word before, if I've seen what the correct word is spelled like, my brain will literally say, that's wrong. You have to make it right and like for spell like I've, oh, I've never failed a spelling test yeah just generally I've never studied for anything that's not to say there are times that I haven't failed right uh, there have definitely been times that I have failed tests and stuff like that but for the most part I've never studied in my life for anything and more times than not it, it, it always helped me out and there, there used to be times too where my mom was like I've never seen you study for anything ever and I'd be like well yeah but I come home with like 90s and 100s on my tests most of the time so it was it was it was a blessing hey. i gotta study hey. don't worry about that noise around you just do your best to concentrate okay all right oh am i gonna get guts with this one that's incredible that's incredible joker <laughs> Oh, I think that was it. That's the rank up. Oh, we got bold. So I think we can go back to uh, what's her name? Wait, what was the bold one? Was that was that Takami? I think that's what we needed. Sweet. All right, dude. Knowledge takes forever. We are still stupid. Even all the studying we've done. We should call it quits for today. Can I can study at home, right? <clears throat> I think I can study. Yeah, I think I can. Can I study uh, at home or can I only study at school? Let me save really quick, too. Just, It's been a while. It's been a couple hours since I saved. So I, I, it's been three hours, roughly three hours since I saved. So, uh, two and a half. So, um, okay, I'm going to study some more. Oh, no. This one? Yo. You're free to study. Oh, yep. Rain makes it easier to focus and study on those days have a greater effect plan accordingly and take advantage of rainy nights or rainy days now listen up all right let's study make sure you close up all right bud you have a good night <clears throat> wow whoa you can answer these difficult problems you're amazing <laughs> all right what are your thoughts <laughs> let's see Still nothing? How? How is it still nothing? Yep. No studying with Anne? Eh, you win some, you lose some. It's my first playthrough. <clears throat> Lame LMFAO. <laughs> Raffle L LMFAO. Did Kamoshida have a psycho? Okay, okay, so this is like just passing the time and random gossip amongst students in the hall well now we then begin? let the first day of exams begin although the lines connect oh this is easy what the heck oh yeah it's an oh are we being tested on everything that we did overall yeah that's an optic illusion let's do it let's go boys let's go I'm about to ace this test right now let's see an, an, an essay question it looks tough but calm down and think about it think it through What's the best reason why people will see the same thing differently? If how they're seeing things is different, 
it probably has to do with that kind of information, okay? If how they, they're they seeing things differently, it probably has to do with this kind of information. Uh, visual. Takes the uh, visual information from your eyes and processes it in the... <laughs> the marrow, <laughs> the brain. Right, um, visual information. So the reason why people see things differently is... They have different cognition, their visual acu <laughs> acuity. Okay, their vision, their different cognition. How the brain interprets the same vision. Yeah, this is literally like, yeah, yeah you finished in time. Good shit. Time is up. Put down your pencils and put your hands under your desks. That's weird. Okay. Ergo, I don't need to study. <laughs> I didn't study for any of that, and I just knew it because it's a one and done. For me, at least, it's a one and done. Like, all I have to do is just see it, experience it once, and it's like... I, I have, like, a steel vice. Today's the second day of exam. Okay, give me a second. I really have to go to the bathroom, so... Anyways, all right, we are back. Doing this exam. We're gonna ace it, hopefully. Ah, uh, okay, which of the following expressions came from the name of the position? Uh... uh I don't want to say it. Hold on. Uh... Something's patronage, magistrates, patronage. There you go. Ooh, we can do this. Yes. Nice. What is the origin of the English word talent? Uh, hold on. That was. Ah, oh, shit. Hold on. Talent. Talent. It was kin something. What is the origins of the English word talent? The name of a sum of currency? I think it's the currency. The name of a saint. The name of an artist. I can't look at the network, can I? I'm gonna click on it. Okay, you can't. Okay, you can't. Um, I want to say the name of currency. I want to go with currency. I really have no other answer. Oh, thank God. Okay. I, I, like, that was, like, the first thing I was like, it's currency. It has to be currency. And then I was double, I was doubting myself at that point. <clears throat> Woo! Using your brain for a game. Tell me about it. <laughs> all right, here we go. Oh, my God. Oh, yeah, it's the exams all of these days. Damn it. I wanted to go to the hot springs on Thursday. Okay, class. All right, today's the Thursday of your exams. Go ahead and get started. What did the Greek philosopher Socrates say that evil is born from? Well, I gotta look at the examples, because he said a lot of things. Ignorance, desire, curio- Fuck. It's not curiosity. Evil is born from- I think it's desire? Oh, no. Or it's ignorant? It's either ignorance or desire. I'm trying to think about the story that they talk- Damn, dude. I, I read it once and that was it. Like, who would have thought that that would have been relevant now? That's so cool. Socrates says that evil is born from ignorance. Socrates says that evil is born from desires. I'm gonna go with ignorance. Okay, oh my god. Uh, what's the least number of colors needed to paint, Jap to paint Japan so that no two- Uh, oh, I did that. I did that. It's, uh... It was, it was four, wasn't it? Oh God, I remember that, hold on. Oh shit, I think it was four. I think it was four. That's like my gut initial. I'm trying to visualize it. I'm gonna go with four. Oh, keep them coming, boys! Oh my gosh, dude, I'm acing this. I'm fucking acing this, watch. I am acing this right now. Is this the last day? I think this is the last day. Uh, please don't screw up. I want to get a perfect score. And then the day of the scores, the day we get our scores back, I have to plant my, I have to water my plant or I have to nourish my plant because that'll be two weeks at that point. Oh my gosh, so sleepy. I ended up pulling an all-nighter once I realized today's the last day of exams. You staying up studying? Nah, I gave up on the exam. I was playing. <laughs> I was playing, dude. That was literally me in seventh grade. That's why I stayed back. I literally was just like fuck studying. Who gives a shit about school? I just want to play video games all day and play Yu-Gi-Oh all day. 
Uh, then before I knew it, it was morning. You're failing for sure. <laughs> I know that feeling. Bull, you say that, but you probably be t uh, spe you probably spent the whole night studying. <sighs> morning. Oh, it's no longer pollen morning season. Yo, look who's y look who else is yawning. Exams are almost over, so I thought I'd make one last effort across the finish line. Mm. Impressive, Lady On. You're quite different from this stupid monkey. <laughs> Is he talking about Ryuji? That's so fucked up if he is. Don't give me that crap. Your brain's tiny compared to mine. Size is meaningless if noth if there's nothing inside, you know. What was that? Aw, oh, damn. Dude, these two are like best bros right there. These two like get along so well. Will you please shut up? You're gonna make me forget everything I meant. Uh, I memo. Huh? Huh? Is it that kid again? Am I imagining things? You need the bathroom? What's wrong? She's being- she keeps- she keeps saying that she feels like she's being watched. What, you see a groper or something? Jesus Christ. No, that's not it. It's nothing. <sighs> Morgana's pissed. He's like, who's disturbing my- Oh! Animation? Okay. Is this the kid? Bad. What do you mean? Hey, at least act like you care. <laughs> Fine. Come on. Uh, hold on. I think I remember his. Hold on. Are they setting him up? Okay. Uh oh. Oh, shit. <laughs> yeah, it's him. From the opening. Uh, pretty boy on top of that. <laughs> hey, uh... Is this, uh... Him, or are you I don't want to... I don't want to press anything. Uh, not that. Is there something you want? <laughs> That's my line! You are the one stalking me! Um? Stalking you? That's outrageous. I know you've been following me. Ever Why is that? Train. Why does that voice sound so familiar? Oh my God! Who is that? My goodness! Oh, the dude! Left the car. So this is where your passion led. All is well that ends well. Madarama, no. <laughs> All right. You're next on my list, pal. You're next on my list, dude. I'm gonna steal your heart once we find out what scumbag you are. I saw you from the car, and I couldn't help myself from oh, chasing Oh, who you. is this voice? Dude. Oh, that's McCree? No way. What? Matt Mercer? Is that where I'm hearing him? Does he do any other voices? Because it sounds like... His his voice sounds familiar, but it's not a McCree familiarity that that I'm that I'm hearing. That's pretty crazy that it, that it's at, that's the same dude who does the same dude that does thing, but that's not the name that I was. That's not what it reminds me of. I saw you from the car, and I couldn't help myself from chasing after you, uh, Mr. Casanova over here. I didn't even notice the calls from Sensei, but thank goodness I caught up to you. Dude, that is bugging me out right now. I didn't notice the calls from Sensei, but thank goodness I caught up to you. Is this boy, uh, Inari? Uh, that's the name that they said in the- right at the very beginning of the game, then when they were calling out, like, Joker, Skull, Inari. I think that's his name. Okay... And he's got, like, uh... He had, like, a, like almost like- I don't know what the ter what the term is. Is like a kabuki mask he had on, or like uh, it looked, it reminded me of like an Anbu Black Ops mask that they wear in Naruto, uh, that he was wearing in his silhouetted thing in the in, at the beginning of the game too. What? You're the woman I've been searching for all this time. Please, won't you? Dude, oh my god! If he doesn't, if he doesn't play the character, he rem his voice sounds so close to a character that I'm that I'm trying to think about. Wait a minute. I 
be the model for my next art piece. Oh, his inspiration? M model? Oh, she is a model, isn't she? That makes sense. Ira! Yes! Oh my god! Thank you! Oh my god, yes! That's who he sounds like! He sounds like Ira from Kingdom Hearts Key Back Cover. That's him. That's literally him. Holy shit. I was like, and we just played Kingdom Hearts Key like a couple weeks ago. Like we watched it. That's why it sounds, I was like, dude, who is this? It sounds, yeah, Ira's the unicorn. Yeah, the unicorn, the guy who was in charge of the unicorn union. In Kingdom Hearts Union Cross or Kingdom Hearts Key Back Cover. Oh my god, thank god, dude, I, I would have been like, it would have been aching me the, every time I heard his voice to try to figure out who it was. All that I've drawn till now has been lacking, but I feel a passion from you unlike anyone else. Yeah, that's definitely you, Ira. This man's highly suspicious. <laughs> yeah, he's making a move on your girl, dude. Mr. Steal your girl over here. Ain't this a recruit for some shady business? So I'm thinking, right? I'm thinking that that Mada Made Rama or Mada Rama dude, I, I don't remember his his name, but the the guy whose heart we're going to go after next. I assume maybe he steals people's art and like passes it off as his own cuz that one dude he was like like that other guy like left me out on the street after what he did to me or whatever. And this guy's like an actual, that's his sensei. Uh, that guy is this dude's sensei, so... And he's an artist too, so I wouldn't be surprised if that guy's profiting off of all these other people. Will you cooperate with me? What do you say? What say you, madam? Whoa, hold your horses. Who are you anyways? Okay. Oh, where are my manners? I'm a second year at Kosei High's Fine Arts Division. Oh, okay. My name is Yusuke Kitagawa. Yusuke? Oh, is Inari his uh his code name? Okay, that makes sense. Cause they, they wouldn't call each other's actual names. Okay, so that must be Inari must be his code name. My name is Yusuke. Yusuke, you're a meshi! No, I'm just kidding. My name is Yusuke Kata uh Katagawa. Oh I'm Madurame Sensei's pupil, and I am being allowed residence at his place. Okay, so it is Madurame. I'm striving to become an artist. Dude, you got the artist form, that's for sure. He's got the artist, like, like he looks like an artist. I guess it's maybe because he's just very simplistic, but his hair, I think that's the most artistic part of him. Huh? So to speak. Do you mean that, Madarame? The one who was on Good Morning Japan the other day? Good Morning Japan, Good Morning America, really? <laughs> the very same. The very same. You know who that is? He was introduced as a super famous Japanese style artist who's been recognized all over the world. I wonder why. Uh, but we heard that name the other day in Mementos. Yep. Yusuke. Oh shit, here he is. I'm sorry, Sensei. I'll be right there. That old guy's Matarame? Matarame Sensei's exhibition will begin at the department store near the station tomorrow. I'll be there to help out on opening day. It'd be great if you could give me your answer in regard to being a model then. I bet you have no interest in the fine arts, but I'll give you tickets too. Oh, yo, where's my ticket, bud? I wanna go. Well then, I hope to see you there tomorrow. All right, pal. <laughs> Guys, as easy to read as a book. You're not planning on going, are you? I think I will. Hey, he made his move. Crap, but look at the time. I'll oh, shit, I completely forgot it's school. We have exams. <laughs> I literally forgot all about that. I've memorized that face of yours, Yusuke. Oh, damn, Morgana's out for revenge. No one makes a move on his lady. Oh! What just happened? Did we get a confidant? Was that from Morgana? Who just like went ham? <clears throat> you became acquainted with Matarame's pupil by chance? Hmm. 
That's a little too convenient. It makes me wonder if you're even telling the truth. Hey. Believe what you want to believe. So be it. What I want to know most is your method. Hmm. It's true that Madarame was an unforgivable criminal worthy of the scorn thrown at him. How so? He was an adult who cultivated his own fame and fortune by sacrificing the livelihood of children. Interesting. So is he doing the same thing? Like, is is that kid making, like, all of his protégés, essentially, are, like, building his... building him up to fame at their expense? But how did you discover such horrible deeds that were hidden all these years in such a short time? Huh. Oh, God, why would... No, don't say the metaverse. What are you thinking? Wow. Uh, yo, I don't, I don't know if I should say that. I kind of want to say it to see, to see what, um, I kind of want to say it to see like the, like what is, what her response would be. I don't remember, clearly, oh, come on, I don't remember. All right, let's, um, the metaverse. This metaverse business again? Come on, it's the truth, lady. Fine. Let's suppose that people's hearts can be changed by stealing their treasure, like you've said. Uh, like, like it is. Not, I mean, I've said it, but it is what it is. If so, a different suspicion arises. People have gone mad or lost consciousness, never to recover, like the subway accident in April. I think someone else is out there doing the same thing as me, but they're a piece of shit. That's all I can think of. That's the theory that I have, and I'm sticking to it. Depending on how you look at it, that could be taken as a phenomenon for a sudden change of heart, too. Yes, that is true. Were you related to those as well? No! I don't want to say- Dude, just say no! What the fuck? That ma Every response makes us look bad. You can't say, I don't know, because then that implies that you did do it, but you don't know if that was the result of it. And to say you don't want to say means you're pleading the fifth because you don't want to incriminate yourself. And then not saying anything is just as much the same thing. Ah, uh, come on. I'll just stay quiet. Hmm, I see. <laughs> Fine. Continue telling me about Madarame's case. Keep it concise and only of the truth. Alrighty, you got it. She looked at her clock, so, uh, her watch rather, so she must be running out of time. <laughs> We're gonna summarize this entire game during that, during that interrogation, by the way. Uh, today's the last day of exams, huh? What's wrong? You're taking a lot of time to get through these. Hmm. This doesn't- this isn't going too well. I wouldn't expect a great- What? No! I was doing so- Yo, you better not screw this up for me, dude. I literally aced the entire exam until now. It's over. I would be so upset if I don't get a high score. It's over. How about you? Alright, uh, I'm feeling confident. I'm- I'm feeling confident. I don't know about my- I don't- You traitor. <laughs> Anyways, can we stop talking about the exams? Like it or not, they're gonna come back graded next week. Alrighty. Rather than focus on stuff that's over with. What are you looking at? The usual site. Yeah, the fan site. It's no use. There ain't any useful info. The number of posts are getting less and less, too. Okay. I am not letting this end as a one-hit wonder, okay? There's no point in getting antsy, though. Hmm. I know. Why don't we go eat lunch somewhere? We still have some money left over from the other day. The other day? I have money left over since the start of the game, lady. I want sushi, then. Or domestic raised eel. <laughs> Does that taste better? I don't have that much left. Oh, right. There are those tickets to Madarame's exhibit. That's tomorrow. Oh, wait, that's tomorrow. Don't tell me. Was it love at first sight <laughs> with that Yusuke guy? Ah, uh, then you're gonna break Morgana's heart. It's not like that. Oh, of course not. <laughs> Play it off, dude. Play it cool. Nah, she's probably seeing this as like maybe a, a business opportunity for her since she is a model. When I was watching that special on TV, his artwork was pretty nice. Plus, we've got free tickets. Okay. Besides, this could also be related to what we heard in Mementos. Matarame, was it? Yeah. 
The guy on the- uh, he was just on the screen. I'm curious, too. Hmm. That aside, what should I do about the other two tickets? Wanna go appreciate some fine arts for once? <laughs> Let's do it. Fine arts, huh? <laughs> I suggest we should all go together. Appreciating the fine arts builds character. A phantom thief who can't identify an original is lame. <laughs> yeah, that is true. Well, if everyone's going... It's settled then. I'm looking forward to it. <clears throat> Just the phrase going to an art exhibit sounds kind of mature. I guess. Let's meet at the exhibit entrance tomorrow. <clears throat> Please tell me my Saturday isn't wasted. Please tell me I can do something today. Why am I not surprised? Okay. Now Morgana is gonna force me to go to bed. <laughs> I'm curious to know if this Madarame has anything to do with the name we heard in Memento. Whatever the case may be, we can't be too, uh, we can't be late. Better get to bed early. Uh, yeah, early on top of that. So I keep thinking about what Nakanohara said. Could he be talking about the famous artist Madarame? Nice catch. <laughs> Seconded. Great. The name really stood out to me. Uh, yeah, I mean, you guys ever heard of someone called Madarame? It's really not common at all. If what we heard is true, Kaitagawa-kun is studying under a corrupt teacher. You mean a teacher who treats people like tools? Yeah, that's what I called. His life is probably pretty terrible. Gotta look into this. Come on, can I make lockpicks? Morgana! I want my life back, dude. I want my life back, that's it. That's it, I want my life back. I should write something. I want my life back. This cat literally runs my life. <laughs> I can't sleep 100%. <laughs> oh, you hold on. You guys can't see that. Look, sleep is at 100%. Morgana runs our freaking life. He literally runs our life. That is Morgana in a nutshell. Oh my gosh, that is crazy. Hey, don't oversleep. I mean, this piece might actually be worth looking at after all. Sleep. <laughs> That's so ridiculous, Morgana. Come on, dude. Oh no, we're losing the crowd. We're at 5% now. Dude, we need to make moves. We're losing we're losing our, our fan base right now. Okay. Is this some kind of cult? Sauce, please. <laughs> Who made this site? Ridic? Thieves should be arrested? Never heard of them. Interesting. A lot of great people online nowadays, I should say. Okay, it's early in the day. Let's check. Oh, nice. We're in our casual wear. So crowded. It'll be a pain in the ass if someone sees you, so don't stick your head out too much, all right? <clears throat> Let's see. Hey, okay. he's here. Nice. Um, yeah. You really came. What'd you expect when you left us those tickets? Hey! Morgana is more of a jailer than the twins. <laughs> yeah, he's the one who really keeps us, like, shackled from, like, the outside world. He's like, go to bed now. I'm gonna be standing right here, perched up by the stairs so you don't leave. Alright, uh, thank you for the bits, bud. Make sure that you don't get in the way of the other visitors. Come now, I'll show you around. I'd like to speak more about the picture I'd like to draw, too. Oh, yeah, he's her inspiration. I mean... She's his inspiration. I said that backwards. She's his inspiration for his next piece. Well, see you guys later. I hope he's not like. Will Lady Hun be all right? <laughs> what if he drags her behind some painting and try something funny? I love the anime. I love like these little two D animations that that go on with Morgana. Like his are the most vibrant. I'm uh, the most, I guess, animated, so to speak. Even though they're two D. I told you not to come out. Are we really gonna appreciate the fine arts? Can't we just go home? Hopefully this guy isn't like an artist like Mr. Jefferson is. Uh, for any of you guys who played Life is Strange, I'll just leave it at that. But uh, hopefully it's nothing like that. Let's learn about Madarame. I guess we should do a quick pass through at once. Yeah. Uh, which way are we supposed to start? Hmm? Oh, there he is, right there. From the other day. We continue to be truly surprised by your imagination. 
Yeah, I don't think those are even his. You have such expansive styles. It's hard yep. to believe that it all stems from one person. Yep. That's fucked up, dude. Somebody did all of these paintings. Someone different did all these paintings, and he just, like, took their credit. Yeah, that's... Dude, artists deserve recognition. And this guy's, yeah, uh, it's not cool. Where in the world does all your inspiration come from? The people who actually do it. <laughs> well, it is rather difficult to put into words. They naturally well up from within my heart, like bubbles rising one after another in the spring. Come on, dude. You couldn't come up with something better? Naturally, you say. What's important is to distance oneself from worldly desires, such as money and fame. Even though you have all of that coming your way because of these paintings. My atelier is a modest shack, but it is more than enough to pursue true beauty. I doubt that. A shack? I see. So the act of emptying one's mind gives rise to inner beauty. Still, to think we could hear the word shack coming from the great artist Madarame. I mean, come on, he's not below saying words, let's be real. <laughs> like, what? He can't say a word? Like, he, uh, you're, you're above that word. You would understand if you saw it. <laughs> yeah, this guy is definitely not, not a savory dude. Wasn't the word shack something? Madarame-san is actually here? Sharp-eyed customer. Took you long. For someone who's very sharp eyed, you're like the last person in the room to realize that. Over there! I'm so glad I came on opening day! <laughs> Fangirl! Oh shit! Hey, stop pushing! There's way too many people! The fangirls are in. <laughs> yes! Crush him so I may have my knights back! Anyways, we gotta head for the exit! Don't die on us, alright? I didn't know there were so many types of Japanese art. He said something about Shaq. He was like, isn't Shaq the name of something? Or like, wasn't that word something? Usually, one concentrates on their own style. However, Sensei creates all this by himself. Uh, no he doesn't. Stop lying He's for him. special. Yeah, a different kind of special, but... There you are, Yusuke. Hmm. Sensei. Ah, the girl from yesterday. Are you enjoying the exhibit? I don't know how to put it into words, but it's really amazing. Hmm. You're sensing something from the artwork. That alone is enough to give us artists satisfaction. Us artists, right? I hope this becomes a wonderful piece, Yusuke. Well then, if you'll excuse me, You'd imagine artists would be difficult to approach. But he seems really friendly. It's because he's not an artist. Indeed. Oh, this is it. The painting I wanted to see in person. That one looks pretty nice. This one? That looks really nice. I guess it's the painter's anger? I'm not sure, but I sense this strong frustration from it. To think <laughs> such a cheerful and gentlemanly person could make such a piece. Ah, <clears throat> uh, yeah, look at that. That's probably his painting. That's probably his painting. Something wrong? Don't mind me. Yeah. There are better pieces than this one. Come now, this way. Yeah, that's probably hey. his. He's not getting credit. Look at that. It's fucked up, man. Ah. That old lady totally elbowed me. <laughs> Ryuji got wrecked. Thanks to that, I remember now. About what? Oh, the word shack. Well, let me get to it. It's about a post online. Oh. Uh, Here, look at this. Here comes the detective work. Like the mute. This music reminds me of like detective work being done. Why'd you leave without me? Hey, you keep your voice remember, down, lady. We got dragged into this huge crowd, and 
<laughs> this is why you credit sources, folks. <laughs> exactly. Persona 5's letting it be known. Emotionally bonding with you, hey, what's up, Luke? Thank you for the resub, dude. Three months in a row. Welcome to the stream, my guy. Glad to have you back. Uh, anyways, you gotta look at this, too. This post might be about Madarame. Ooh. What's it say? A master of the Japanese arts is plagiarizing his pupil's work. Yep. Only his public face is shown on TV. Called it. Plagiarizing? That's a big crime. That's actually like I didn't a crime. Think much of it when I first saw it, but hearing Shaq and Madarame triggered it. Hmm. I knew it. I knew it, dude. You put the pieces together early, and it comes together like real. I I, I feel like super satisfied that I was able to. Like, be on par with a lot of the stuff that's happening. His treatment of the pupils who live with him is awful. He teaches nothing and bosses them around. Wow. He treats them inhumanely, as if disciplining a dog. Abuse on top of plagiarism, huh? Yeah, it looks like we if found our target. Real, it'll be a huge scandal. I wonder if Kitagawa-kun posted this. I was thinking that. I was like, I wonder if that's, uh... I wonder if that's, uh, Yusuke's post. I mean, he is a pupil of his. <clears throat> Who knows? It's anonymous and all. In that case, it's possible the Madarame we heard about in Mementos is referring to the same one. Yeah. A man like that doing such a thing? What do you mean, a man like that? He's putting up a front. I wonder if we can ask that shadow from earlier about this. <laughs> we just become friends with a shadow. Oh, actually, we just need to talk to him in reality. There you go. Now you're using your noodle. And how are we gonna go about that? Are we gonna explain it all, starting with mementos? <laughs> Besides, if we make a move out in the open, there's the possibility that Madarame will find out. Oh, yeah, <clears throat> right. Okay. Hey, what do you think about Madarame? Doesn't he seem suspicious? He seems too laid back. That post might be a fake. Yeah, he does. I know, right? This all fits way too well <clears throat> to just be a coincidence. If this post is legit, ain't this the kind of target we've been waiting for? Mm-hmm. We got our next well, target, yeah, baby. But is it really true? By the way, what did you do about the whole modeling thing? Kitago Akun gave me his contact info. And the address to his sensei's atelier. The shack. <laughs> if he lives there, right? Perfect timing. Yep. Let's try going tomorrow. We're off to Madarame's house right after school. Huh? You want me to model tomorrow? This is too sudden. What? We're just gonna go talk to Kitagawa. Oh. Is it? Is it? Is it pronounced? I look forward to emotionally bonding with you. Hey, what's up, Kyle? Thank you for the resub, dude. I was just about to say, like, he. Is it pronounced? Isn't it pronounced Kitagawa? Are they pronouncing it like <laughs> they're like Americanizing the pronunciation? Oh, that's what you meant. Yeah, Kitagawa. Okay. I think they're saying it differently then. Okay. All right, if the rumors are true, might, this will be exactly what we need. Dude, can I not do anything? Aw, oh, man. I guess that's why they gave us so much free time to do stuff beforehand. Because now Morgana's calling all the shots. We can't do anything with, uh, with ourselves. Yeah. Oh, we're back up to 6%. That's good. Oh yeah, the great artist Madarame is holding an ex ex <clears throat> is holding an exhibition in Shibuya right now, isn't he? I've gone to see his work a number of times. Goodness, are they magnificent. Uh, the moment I saw them, I knew he was something else. Yeah, it's so disgusting now because it's like none of those are his. And everyone has just a, a warped perception of his- of who he is because of the fact that he's like plagiarizing and lying on a grand scale. By the way, you seem far removed from the artist, from the arts, Kuduzukun. Here's a question. Ah, uh, of course. Do you know who created the piece which sold for the highest price back in the 20th century? 
I mean, that wasn't that long ago. Picasso, Van Gogh, Madarame. I wish I knew this. Uh, isn't Picasso and Van Gogh, like, pre... 20th century? Like, the 20th century is like the 1900s. It sold in the 20th century. The highest price. Shit. Um. Clearly, it's either Picasso. I want to say Van Gogh. I want to say Van Gogh. Because, uh, I watched this one episode of, um, I think it was Doctor Who, but I watched this one episode where, like, they brought Van Gogh to, like, the modern day, the modern era, and, like, had him, like, in the, in the hall of, like, in a hall of, like, all of his work, and, like, the, 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 like, the exhibitor explained, like, how Van Gogh is probably, like, the best artist of all time with him in there, and he didn't know it was him. Picasso, like, I know about Picasso, but, um... I wouldn't say I, I I don't know I I know I I just know more of Van Gogh, and also quick little fun note uh, I met somebody on League of Legends one time and we're friends on League now. His username was uh <laughs> uh oh, what's what's it's Vince is it Vince Van Gogh Vincent Van Gogh I think that's like his official name. The guy's username for League of Legends was Vincent Van Gogh. <laughs> So, I got a really good laugh out of it because I got the reference that he was making. But yeah, long story short, I'm gonna go with Van Gogh, final answer. Oh, nice, it was right. Okay, and I'm pretty sure we're gonna have final exams, so I need to pay attention to this too. It seems you know a thing or two after all. This piece was purchased from the equivalent, for the equivalent of 18 Billion yen <laughs> and was sold for even more later. Wow. However, since the turn of the 21st century, a new record has been set practically every year. Nice. Nice going. Okay. Hey! Is that it? Did it level up? Ah, oh, come on. How did I not level up anything? Alright. Knowledge, come on. I need that knowledge. People put a serious amount of passion and money into art. If I had if I had that kind of money, I wouldn't mind having a painting or two myself. Hey, hey. Seems like art can make you a tidy sum. Let's see with our own eyes whether or not the accusations of him stealing art are true. You're meeting Lady On and the others at the train station, right? Let's go when class lets out. Alrighty. <clears throat> <clears throat> Phantom thieves going by train. This ain't any different from how I got home from school, you know? The train's the fastest way to go, plus we can bring pets on here. No! <laughs> Who are you calling a pet? Dude, be quiet! We didn't pay the pet fare. The pet fare. Blah, blah. I'm the one guiding you to your destination. You should be calling me master. Hey! Oh, no! Oh, kitty! Uh, shoot! Is that your pet, mister? I heard it meowing. It's a stuffed animal. <laughs> it's a, st oh God, it's a stuffed animal. Yeah, it's just a toy. It meows when you push on its head. Hey. You heard that, Akira? Push on its head. This is ridiculous. <laughs> <laughs> Meow. <laughs> yeah, Morgana's, uh... oh, how the mighty have fallen. Let's just leave it at that. Wow, we again, again. Oh, God. Time to button mash. <laughs> Time to button mash. I should press gently. I'll press forcefully. <laughs> right, let's do button mash. Meow. Uh, I'm so sorry, Morgana. Okay, kid, you need to get lost, okay? You're gonna break my toy. I just threw up in my mouth. <laughs> Seriously? The next stop is Shibuya. Shibuya. Doors will open on the left. That's our stop. Get lost, kid! Bye-bye! <laughs> and rip Morgana, everybody. <laughs> Time to get our knights back. Yeah. 
Uh, so which line you gotta transfer to? Um, if anything, this is the closest station. For real? For real? That kind of phantom thief takes- uh, what kind of phantom thief takes the train and then walks to their destination? Stop your complaining! It's supposedly a shack, but this is the neighbor- but this is the neighborhood he lives in, as expected of a famous artist. Alright, let's do it! Um... Let's see, head to Madarame's house. Alrighty. Access way? Oh, uh, nope! Okay, we gotta go to Central Street? I guess I gotta go this way instead. Do, do, do! <laughs> Ryuji for real! Alright, underground walkway? Oh, nope! I goofed! Oh, this way. Uh. This way, uh, maybe? Oh, no, that's underground. Ba -da -ba 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 -da -ba. Wait. Um. I suppose it'd be in a residential area past. Okay, okay, okay. So we have to go walk right past everything. Suguru Kamashita. Oh. Former Olympian. Teacher at Shujin Academy. This guy again, the dir uh, uh, the SIU director. Reason for turning himself in is uh, a heavy conscience, huh? The human mind doesn't change that easily. Hmm. Let alone their natural temperament. <sighs> He's on to something. Shujin Academy. Seems doubtful. I'm calling it. This guy's the final boss. Perhaps I'll have someone look into it. Just in case. Okay. I don't know. Everyone's pretty shifty in this game. I don't know who to trust. Is... That it? We're at the right address. Yo, that pre-rendered background, though. <laughs> the door plate does say Matarame. Uh, you ring the bell. Me? The walls won't collapse when I do, will they? <laughs> oh, damn. Talking about his humble abode. No one sneeze or we'll blow this house down, okay? Nice. Who is it? Oh, it's Yusuke. Is currently. Um, it's Takamaki. Takamaki. I'll be right Tachimaki! People really do live here. Takamaki, sir. Ah, uh, caught you off guard. We're with her too. You two are here as well. <laughs> hey. In the flesh. Sorry, but uh, we ain't here to talk about the modeling thing. There's something we gotta ask you. Is it true Matarame's plagiarizing stuff? He's abusing people too, yeah? Are you serious? Oh, damn, dude. Taking it straight to his front door. Literally. We read about it online. Hmm. This? <laughs> oh, no. That sounds like an evil anime laugh. Preposterous. Not only is the plagiarism impossible, but abuse? If he hated children so much to harm them, he would never allow pupils into his home. All right, you got pretty defensive there, bud. And I'm the one residing here and studying under him. I'm saying it's not true, so it's beyond doubt. Uh, I mean, that's it's an online post, dude. What the hell? Why would you get that upset about it? You might be lying about it. Yeah, true. That... That is utter rubbish. I had no family when Sensei took me in and raised me into what you see now. Ah, uh, damn. That's all the more reason for you to defend him. If you continue to ridicule the man I owe my life to, you will rue this day! Alright, pal. Uh, alright. <laughs> Leave well enough alone for now, I guess. You really think that? Yusuke. Oh, damn. What's the matter? I heard you yelling. These people are slandering you with baseless rumors. Forgive them, Yusuke. They must have heard some bad rumors and came in worry for their friend's safety. Yeah. <sighs> Understood, Sensei. 
Damn, dude. How, how do you not have that level of foresight to realize that, man? Come on. Well, even I doubt that a cranky old man like myself could be liked by everyone. <laughs> That's not what we meant. I'm sorry to have butt in on your conversation. However, I do have neighbors around. Won't you please keep it down? Now, if you'll excuse me. Alrighty. <clears throat> that was discourteous of me. I'm sorry. Hmm. I know. I think you'll be able to believe in Sensei if you saw that painting. It's his maiden work, as well as his most representative Ooh. piece. It's titled Sayuri. Sayuri. Sayuri? This was the painting that inspired me to become an artist. It's so beautiful. Hmm. I don't know all this fine art stuff, but even I can tell that this is impressive. That's a really nice painting. When I first saw you, I felt the same powerful emotion as when I saw this painting. And a chase down the street for you, like a real gentleman. Me? I wish to pursue beauty like this. And I believe drawing you will be part of that pursuit. I implore you, seriously consider my offer. <laughs> Morgana's probably pissed right now in that bag. I'm sorry that you took the time to come all this way, but I must assist Sensei today. I hope that we can discuss this further another time. If you'll excuse me then. Hmm. Those two seem like nice guys, don't they? I mean, everybody. I mean, Kamushita did too. No? Maybe the Madarame we heard about in Mementos is a different person. Man, right when we thought we found a new target too. Hmm. How's the MetaNav? Oh. Hey, the app. Oh shit! Is it activating here? Was it picking up our conversation? This display. It means that Madarame has a palace too. Oh shit! Gotcha, bitch. But why? Madarame, plagiarism, and then Shack, huh? These seem to be the keywords. Okay. For real though, what the <laughs> hell is going on? For real? Does an old man like him really have a palace? We have the person's name and the location. All that's left is the what that Madarame mistakes the shack for to enter his palace. Oh yeah, that's right. Not, it's not a castle. Uh, a museum? A gallery? You mean like how Kamoshida thought the school was his castle? Huh. That's right. Uh, his 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 canvas? I don't know. Let's try saying some things. They can be random guesses. I just gave you three right there. Have fun. <laughs> it's a bit sudden, though. Why don't we start with castle? No candidates found. Then what about prison? No candidates found. No candidates found. Ah, what a pain. Um. Jail, a warehouse, and guidance counseling office. Might as well add farm. Ah, uh, come on, dude. The reason why it was a castle was because Kamushita thought he was king. So if this guy thinks he's like a grand painter and he wants everyone to believe that, it's relative to art. Not a single hit. Should we come back another time? What do you call this place? His his atelier? Is that is that what it is? Maybe. A building that's related to artists. If we think from there, what would? Why it is be? why like look at that? An is so smart. Like come on, Ryuji. Like I said, it could be either a museum, a gallery, uh, uh an. Uh, Atelier, whatever that is, a canvas. I don't know. It could be any. I think it's any one of those. An art school, a museum. An art school, a museum, maybe. Oh shit! I got it. Nice. Good shit, dude. I am so happy I got that right. Makes sense though, right? I mean, where do you find fine art? In a museum. In a gallery. Hey, oh, what? This place looks so dope. When did you activate the nav? You surprised me. Didn't have much of a choice. It, I think it, we just happened to get it right. What if I wandered off? Even so, you can slip into the metaverse without realizing it, Morgana. Yep. In the, in a place with minimal cognitive distortion, 
difference can be subtle. What? Forget that. Look. Yo, he's got a massive museum with a ton of people lined up. The shack is seriously some kind of museum. Hey. Let's go check it out. Interesting. Interesting, interesting. <clears throat> it's so extravagant to the point that it's gaudy. Yeah, especially when he said like he was like as an artist, you have to give up worldly possessions like money and fame. But then he wants people lining up to, to see his work. And I'm pretty sure they're paying a hefty price for it. It's a museum, right? This is Matarame's? A palace is a scenery driven by desires. Just like how Kamoshida's palace was a castle. Yeah. Matarame's artwork is on display at museums in reality too, though. But they're not his! This exhibit was popular, and people already respect him. Why would he fantasize about a museum? He got a point. It ain't related to plagiarism or abuse, either. Hmm. Interesting. Let's try looking around. Racking our brains here won't do us any good. Right. That aside, ain't a museum a must for Phantom Thieves? Oh, yeah, dude, we're in our element right now. A museum? Dude, we have, like, everything's ripe for the picking for us. <laughs> yeah, definitely. Now that's our joker. Hmm. I feel the same. Nice. But man, just look at that insane crowd. Oh, okay, here it is. Yes. Time to begin our infiltration. Alright. Alright, let's get going. Dude, look at this. This place is pretty. This is this is a lot different than the uh than the palace. Cause everything at least was indoors. This is different. This is definitely different. Alrighty. Time to yep. Time to go hunting the big fish. We got some big fish to fry today, boys. Alright, let's go check it out. Alrighty. Oh, okay. All right, so we got guards. Oh, what is that? Mine now, unsigned mug. All right, uh, hold on. I can feel it. I can feel it. Can I get the drop on this dude? The exhibit is now closed for today. We await your return. Okay. Hey, send more guards over here. Just the two of us won't be able to handle, deal with this whole crowd. Oh. This is our this is our chance. It looks like the security is focused on the front entrance. That means there'll be less anywhere else. Okay. Um let's do it. I'm going to save right here actually. We're still going to keep going. I'm going to make it a little bit further because it is uh 8 p.m. Well, it's about to be 8 p.m. in a few minutes. So, I'm going to kind of Oh no, I can't. Okay, never mind. I can't go that way. I got to go this way instead. Somewhere. All right, this is gonna be fun. I can see it. Ooh, look at this, dude. This place is a lot more livelier than the palace. I, I will admit. It's somewhere. Focus. All right. Jump. I can see it. Okay, grab this. It's oh, somewhere. dude, that guy. Can I just like assassinate, like Assassin's Creed, just land on him? What's over here? Focus. Oh, okay, I can I can jump down, I think. Alright. I have something. There's more stuff over Meow. Grab you. Oh, okay. We can get in from the top. And get in through the sky. Hey! Skylight. Oh, the skylight's open. I think we can get in here. But it's pretty far down. Be able to get back out of here. Uh, out this way. Don't worry, I have a rope. <laughs> I'm our tool specialist after all. Oh, that's true. Dude, we need an escape rope like from Pokemon that automatically teleports us out of the room. So what's your call, Joker? You wanna head inside? Let's do it. Let's do it, baby. Museum special exhibit room. Okay. How suspicious. It's quiet. Too quiet. Hey, this! It's moving. 
Come on, we're in a palace. That ain't anything to be freaking out over. Dude, are we gonna put? Are they pulling a Mario 64? We're gonna jump into these paintings. Unsigned mug. Uh oh. Okay, hold on a sec, Joker. Let's take a look at those paintings first. Okay. Jumping on in. Hmm. Some kind of explanation. Here? Let's see. It's someone's name and age. What the hell? That can't be the title of the painting, right? Do you think it's the artist's name? Let's check the other paintings, too. I think it might be something important about them. Oh, you know what? That'll be interesting if we get all of the names of the true artists, and then we go and interrogate them in the real world to kind of verify if, uh, if all of these accusations are true. I'm pretty sure that's what's going to happen. I'm curious about the other painting, too. Come on, let's go check the next room. Okay. Let's see. This one has a full name. Another. It's the name and age on the plaque. All right. I can feel it. Mine. Devil fruit. Oh shoot! One piece. Where you at? I can feel it. It's somewhere. All right. Oh, another one. Oh, another devil fruit, baby. Bad sculpture. I'll take it. Hmm. Unsigned. Yo, we got a lot of unsigned mugs here. What's what's going on with that? Hey. Hey, this doesn't make any sense. Madarame is famous for having a variety of art styles, but all the portraits on display here look the same. This is way different than what was at the. Wait a second. Oh, that guy's did. That one's different. Oh, that's the dude. That's the guy in the memento. You know, the one who was shit-talking Madarame. His name's written on the plaque. Dude, I don't get it. Why is there a painting of him in here? And more importantly, why is his name written under it? You're right. Doesn't art usually have, like, the name of the piece or the artist's name? It's quite the mystery. Oh, wow. The plot's thickening, everybody. That bowl cut, though. <laughs> Looking like my boy Rock Lee over here. Except he doesn't have the bushy brows, but you know, I digress. I have something. Okay, let's let's keep it going. This is a different. I like this different kind of like um, investigation <sighs> approach. What? No way. Oh, it's uh, Yusuke. Hey, isn't this a painting from of that guy? It says Yusuke. Huh? Wait a second. What about what? Wait. What do you think these paintings are? Patrons of the museum, Madarame's pupils. It would have to be their, their 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 pupils, right? Perhaps. I think you're right. What? For real, all of them. But it was only Yusuke when we went to the place before. Yeah, that's because it's he's going down. He's going down the list. He's going down the list essentially. So he's had a lot of apprentices. This must be former apprentices as well. Only one remains now. Taking into account, uh, said earlier, things are getting clearer. Hmm. All right, let's keep investigating. We need something to further confirm our deductions. All righty. <laughs> for real? I think that's like at least 30 for real so far. <clears throat> let's see, let's see, let's see. Focus. Let's keep going. Oh, a treasure chest. Oh, and I have a lot of lockpicks this time around. I saw another treasure chest around this side of the... Uh, around the side of the stairs. Uh, seems like some pamphlets are here. What's up? You find something? Uh, we're here to investigate, so we should check everything and ca that catches our attention. Like this treasure chest! Protect mask. Alrighty. I'm gonna grab that one down there, too. Joker. Oh! Oh! We have 11! Yeah, damn straight we have 11. Nice. Ooh, training whip, pearl, and snuff soul. I can feel it. Alrighty. Okay. I kind of want to change my equipment really quick. Uh, equipment. All right, hold on. I just want to make sure I don't have anything else for him. Oh yeah, definitely putting that on. Accessories. Oh, uh, didn't I get? Yeah, the calming. Okay, resist. Resist confusion. 
Oh, uh, the hip glasses don't do anything for me. Plus two strength. Uh, I'll put that on, I guess. All right. Yeah, everything else is lower. I'll put that on him, I guess. Just making sure everyone has the best possible stats. Oh, the well-worn scarf. That goes up by 20. Wow, that's a lot. Oh, training whip. There you go. Goes up by 30 for her. And... Oh, what's the hairpin? Nothing. Okay. Alright. Alrighty. Anywho, pamphlet time. Is this a pamphlet? Uh, this is getting way too detailed for a freaking palace. Why did he bother making something like this? Oh, there's a museum guide on here. Let's take a look. Oh, okay, the map of the palace. That makes a lot of sense. All right, neat. So I'm gonna keep playing until I find my first, uh, until I find my first safe room. And whenever I find a safe room, I think that's where I'm gonna, Focus. I think that's where I'm going to um, call it for the stream. I've been, I've been streaming for almost four and a half hours. So I think I made a lot of progress today. And I hope you guys have enjoyed so far. All right, oh, let me grab that. Another pearl. I'll take it. So, next room. Joker, let's check around this room a little close. Oh, okay. You're looking at this piece. Oh, look at that. Oh, wow. Look at that. That's pretty cool. Giant sculpture. Hmm. Oh, look at that cutscene. Oh, are we gonna see Madarame? What he looks like in in this place, like Kamoshida? Infinite Spring, a conglomerate work of art that the great director Madarame created with his own funds. These individuals must offer their ideas to the director for the rest of their lives. Oh damn, feels bad, man. Those who cannot do so have no worth living. Yo, what the fuck? Yo, he's not killing these people off, is he? Hey, this is most likely about the plagiarism, right? Damn it. What a phony geezer. <laughs> You're a phony! A great big fat phony! In other words, his pupils are his property. He doesn't even qualify as an artist if this is true. Yeah. He's stealing the ideas from talented students in exchange for securing their livelihood. Oh, wow, that's fucked up. That's messed up, dude. I wondered about those portraits on display. They must all be his pupils through his cognition. Wow. This even says that they have no worth. Couldn't this be about the abuse? Madarame will keep them around as long as they're useful to him. But the moment they're not... Yeah. He's treating them like slaves or tools! Why is Yusuke keeping quiet about this? He's got no reason to cover this up. Hey, like he said, he saved him when he was a kid. It's kind of like Emerald with Cinder. He did say that he owes Madarame his life for being taken in. But still. When we were at the exhibit, I praised one of the pieces on display. Yeah, and that was probably his. But Kitagawa-kun acted strange. Maybe that piece was plagiarized too. Yeah. What's the call? Ain't this enough to target Madarame? Let's do it. That's what I'm talking about! <laughs> Hold on, you two. We should confirm these facts with Yusuke once more. Confirm what, though? It means we should get solid evidence that such crimes actually took place. True. What a pain. I mean, this is all the evidence that we need. But I guess to make things happen in the real world, we still need confirmation. Besides, there's too much we don't know about Madarame yet. Mm, you're right. I'll try contacting Kitagawa-kun. I might be able to get the truth out of him if I accept his modeling offer. Okay. Wait, you're gonna do that? <laughs> you all better come with me, okay? I'm scared to go alone. Famous, renowned artist, huh? 
Wow, oh, this might be tougher than Kamashita. Interesting. Well, we'll just prep ourselves until we get confirmation from Yusuke. This is our first mission as real Phantom Thieves. Oh, the hype no is what? real, dude. <laughs> we gotta succeed no matter what. Good shit. Am I still in the palace? Oh, no. Okay, we're gone. All right, never mind, then. Mm. The reason why Yusuke is hiding the truth, huh? Would you really forgive someone unconditionally if you owe your life to them? I mean, I know Madarame is a bad person, but still, maybe I'm so hesitant because I haven't really met any of his victims. Yeah, I guess that's part... Th that part's totally different from what happened with Kamushita. This might be an extreme line of thinking, but if an evil person isn't causing any trouble now, is there really a, a point in us stepping in? Well, you got a point. So we're gonna let Yusuke decide if Madarame's worth going after or not. I don't know. If it were me, I'd never forgive that bastard. Let's see how Yusuke feels. Yeah, I guess I could talk some more after that. Okay, let's meet in Shibuya after school tomorrow. Alrighty. Holy shit, we made a lot of progress. We're on, we're on, we're on to our second palace at this point, which is very, very exciting. Uh, really looking forward to seeing how that goes. <sighs> Excuse me. Apologize. Uh, going through a lot right now. Um, let me make a save file now. I think at this point, this is probably a good point to wrap up, chat directly with all of you guys in the chat. I really, really, really liked... I'm really loving where this game is going. Like, everything about this game is getting better and better as, as we play. We got a potential new player, uh, a, ten, a potential new character that's going to be joining our party. Uh, that is Yusuke. We have our up-and-coming second palace after Kamoshida. Um, we have the, 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 the Mementos Metaverse, which is like a little in-betweener, kind of like a, a training ground, so to speak, between the small, like, between, like, the minor quest and the big fish to fry, which is the palace, which are the palaces. Uh, I definitely want to level up a bit, so I'm probably, between tonight and tomorrow, I'm probably going to spend a couple days, actually, I'm not entirely sure. How I want to spend that because I don't want any story stuff to progress without you guys being there um, but I do know that I do need to do a bit of grinding because I think right now at the average level is 13 and I'm level 12 I mean it's, it's not that bad it's one level off but still um, and I and I also want to work on what's his name I want to work on the confidant with uh, um, Mishima so I can get more XP from his uh from his skills and from his abilities that he has yeah this is the next one right here in increase xp earned out of battle and then people who are not in the party also get backup members also get xp which is a win-win so i don't necessarily have to have everyone in my party for them to contribute and level up and whatnot i love the music too I love how like this actual like lyrics now like after the first palace they they just broke out the uh, the new music out of nowhere. Oh, what day is it today too? Cause I need a. I should write something. I need to keep tabs on um. I need to keep tabs on the calendar. So on the twentieth, I need to I need to feed this plant on the twentieth. I gotta make sure I follow up with that. Nice. All right, it's healthy for now. Okay. So I just want to make sure that's all good and dandy. But yeah, um, I hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, a big, big shout out to everyone who followed the stream today. Uh, the last few followers of tonight, we have uh, Yokito, the Polychromatic, and Not Echi Nico. Thank you guys all for the support for the recent follows. If you guys were, if this was your first stream, I really hope you guys enjoyed. And for everybody who's continuously joined and supported, especially the Persona 5 uh, streams that I've done, I really appreciate it. Uh, another big shout out to all of the recent subs and resubs. Uh, the donations and the bits that we've gotten today uh, are really, really greatly appreciated. Uh, I'm going to be heading out for the night, but like I said, I'm going to be getting back into P5 uh, tomorrow. We're going to be jumping into more of Madarame and Yusuke storyline, uh, as well as figuring out our results for the exams and whatnot, doing a bit of grinding and stuff like that. So uh, I'm going to be heading out for the night. Thank you guys so much for your support. Uh, we'll be getting back to P5 more Madarame and uh, you stay in the future. So you guys all have a good night. Take care and I will see you all in the next stream.